Now, the future of meat production may be in a lab. Our Betty Yu visited a San Francisco startup on a mission to make eating, well, easy and sustainable. This looks like a chicken nugget, and it is one, but this piece was made the Silicon Valley way. Looks like a chicken nugget to me. Technically, this is chicken, but this specific nugget came from a chicken that's still alive and free. At food startup just headquarters in San Francisco, scientists are growing meat from animal cells. We work with farmers. Uh, we get a cell from their animals because they know their animals best. We get it from uh, uh, the root of a feather, a slaughtered piece of meat, a biopsy. We bring that cell in. We find nutrients to enable that cell to grow, and we manufacture meat in the cleanest, safest possible way. It tastes like chicken. Because it is chicken. Just a CEO and co-founder Josh Tetrick and I taste tested the company's latest iteration of the chicken nugget, which is not commercially available yet. We toured the company's sprawling facilities in the Mission District. All meat starts with cells. Where scientists study cells that have been harvested, in this case, from a cow. We call it Discovery Lab. In another lab, scientists are figuring out protein contents with the help of robots. The cells are fed nutrients and put in machinery that eventually grows to make meat. Ultimately, Just is trying to figure out how to make the process of creating cell based meat affordable for consumers. And the reality is, there are billions and billions of chickens that are confined and killed every single year. Hundreds of thousands of chickens in a very small area, kind of cramped, uh, eating soy and corn that requires a lot of land and a lot of water and is responsible for an enormous amount of greenhouse gas emissions. And there are also a lot of antibiotics used in the system. Just doesn't need to use antibiotics or even the whole animal. Already, the company has launched Just Egg in grocery stores and restaurants across the country. It's a plant-based liquid egg substitute. In four months, it sold the equivalent of three million chicken eggs. Next up, Just plans to make Wagyu beef from cells. It announced a new partnership with a high-end Japanese supplier. But first, the company needs a green light from the USDA and FDA. The technology is so new, the two agencies recently announced they would oversee the production of cultured meat. Someday. It could be 10 years from now, 20 years from now. The majority of the meat that is consumed on that day, sometime in the future, will not have required a single animal, will not have required confinement and all the environmental issues. The technology is there to do it. While Just waits for the regulatory framework to be established here in the U.S., it hopes to first launch its chicken nugget in Asia sometime this year. On the Night Beat, I'm Betty Yu. Now, Just is one of several Bay Area companies shaping the future of food. Memphis Meats engineered a cell-based meatball in 2016.